Hey everybody, it's John, 3000 Hitman. Today is March 4th, and it's a mail day, a little bit of a mail day, different than cards, but let's get into, I'll give you a sneak peek at what the show's about. Yeah. Oh, fair ball. There you go, using the whole field as Ricky Henderson will run that ball down. Ball is in play, and John Olerud will have a stand-up double. Line drive, fail. How about that? That's going down into the uh, bullpen. Running it down is Trammell, and Olerud will go into third with a triple. So Olerud doubles to left, and now triples to right. It's a pretty good chance. That guy could hit for the cycle tonight. Who knows? Drive in the center field, charging his Katze, has to play it out of high. So now he's three-fourths of the way to the cycle, a single, a double, and a triple. Speaking of driving and runs, Garrett Anderson drove it around in the bottom of the line. Oh! There it is. He has hit for the cycle. How about that? Fuller, it's my turn run of the year. He now has 50 RBIs, and he has hit for the cycle. How many Padres have hit for the cycle? Never. All right, everybody. So there's a sneak peek. It's John Olerud. Let me talk a little bit about him first before I show you what I was able to pick up. Uh, John Olerud played 16 years in Major League Baseball. He had a lifetime average of 295, pretty close to 300. He had 2,239 career hits gotten up there. He got close to that 3,000 mark. Two-time World Series champion back-to-back -back with the uh, uh, Toronto Blue Jays. Two-time All-Star selection, three gold gloves. 1993, he was the American League batting champion. And then he hit for the cycle five times. Uh, you know, with me, with my uh, collection being 3,000 hit, I love hitters and I love watching hitters hit. So what I did was, um, you know, I have more baseballs, more bats than I probably do baseball cards and they're all over the place. So I was able to pick up <clears throat> John Olerud's bat. So this is his bat. Let me flip this around. 1993. Three, I believe, and uh, he was when he had this bat. He was with the uh, New York Mets. Um, you can see, kind of get up close, and I'll give you guys a shot at this. I'll look at it a little bit closer. It's got a number five. Got some good wear on it. It's always amazing. You know how these things feel. And how well balanced, how well balanced they are. So I will show you that up close. Um, for those who don't know, in 1993, he also flirted with 400. He was chasing uh, Ted Williams, and all year long he was he was 395, 396, 398, 400, just like George Brett was. I think a lot of people don't give credit to John Olerud. Quiet man, stayed quiet, consistent, very patient hitter. And um, in that video you saw where he hit for the cycle, he doubled the left, he tripled the right, singled the center, and homered to right field. He used all fields. So it's a great pickup for me, and um, I really like it. The other thing is, um, I will show you after I show you that, is kind of a rare pickup also on a Mike Trout card. So it's a, a rare card. I'm going to show you that, and also David Fletcher. So let's look at those. All right, everybody, so here's the Olerud bat. Got some good wear on here. Good wear on this. Rawlings Adirondack, that's what he used. Got that blue stripe, a little bit of a crack right there. Not bad. Got that pine tar here. And then you can see the bottom he even wrote Olerud would do these to his bats, a 32 inch Olerud. He wrote that on the bottom. He used a 93 in his pursuit of 400. A um, little bit of a pickup in the cards. 
Great little autograph card, David Fletcher. Really consistent, solid hitter for the Angels. Nice card. And look at that. 2015 Don Russ, Mike Trout, reverse error card. Oh, sorry about that. Him hitting left-handed. So I will get that off and get that graded. So, okay, little pickup today. I really enjoyed this one though. So there's that older road. All right, let's go back and finish this thing up. All right, so as you can see, it's a great looking bat, great pickup, a little bit different than a, a uh, card pickup or a card mail day. I love bat, bat mail days. So it's a great bat, goes into the collection. John Olerud, great hitter. Um, I feel he should be in the Hall of Fame, and there's been a couple articles written about why he's not in. Uh, quiet man, and uh, still lives, I believe, in the uh, state of Washington now. Just uh, so, uh, And then the Trout card, it's a great pickup on the Trout card. I'm gonna try to get that sent off to a PSA and get it graded. I haven't seen any more. I'm sure there is a few others, but that reverse uh, negative or reverse uh, photo of Trout hitting left-handed is uh, interesting. And then the pickup on the David Fletcher card. So hope everybody enjoyed it. Uh, next week, I will be coming and looking at another complete set and how to build sets. I'm gonna be looking at another set from the 70s. So stay tuned for that. I hope everybody has a good week. Baseball season is almost here. It's right around the corner, can't wait. I appreciate all the new subscribers, all of them, and the existing subscribers that comment on the contact. I appreciate everything you guys do. Go out, check out a new channel, and uh, comment, and hit subscribe, and let's talk about some stuff. Talk to you guys later.